So I don't think I've ever done this before. I don't think I've ever sat down and formally introduced myself to you guys. If you have found me from TikTok, Instagram, or YouTube, you just see this lady on here telling y'all what y'all should and shouldn't do. Tell them Ash, I am. Y'all see me hosting Money Mondays. Y'all see me doing Ash After Dark. But do y'all even know who I am for real? If you don't, keep watching. I'm finna spill all my tea. So first, my name is Ashley, but you guys know me as Ash. I want you guys to know that I am 36 years old, a plus size, confident woman who is divorced, a mom of two boys. I am an entrepreneur. I own a salon in Nashville, Tennessee, and I have been a licensed cosmetologist for 17 years. That's right, 17. I hope to soon transition into a full-time content creator, which is how you guys probably found me. I am a Christian and God leads my life. I probably should have started with that first. However, those are the foundational things. Those are the core things of Ash. So when we have Money Mondays, I want you guys to know it's just not me out here talking. It is me sharing my 17 years of actual lived business experience. After I got my cosmetology license straight from high school, I went back to school and got my associate's degree in business management with a concentration of entrepreneurship because I knew I wanted to be a business owner. So not only do I have the formal education behind me, but I also have the lived experience, okay? Now, on Tuesdays, we do Tell Them Tuesdays, Tell Them Ash, I do, where I give y'all my opinion on real world situations and how I would handle it. Well, why should I be able to tell people what to do? I'm not an expert, I'm not a therapist, I just have lived a life. I don't have enough time to give y'all a full story of the life that Ashley has lived. But let's just say, even though my birth certificate says that I'm 36, I probably realistically have the lived experience of a, of a 65 year old woman. I swear that's how I feel. My knees be feeling 65, my back be feeling 65, and then my mind tells me I'm a lot older than what I really am. So I like to come and share with you guys my lived experiences. Does that mean that you gotta follow my advice by, by the book, by the tea? Absolutely not. But each one teach one. So that's why we do Money Mondays and that's why I do Tell Them Tuesdays because I know some of y'all don't have the support system. Y'all didn't have the mom, the dad, the grandmother, the big sister. And I love to be the honorary Aunt Ashley, the honorary, you know, big sis to share some information with you guys. Now, on Saturdays, if you have watched my Ash After Dark, okay, you realize that I really am a firm believer in marriage. I am a firm believer in long-term sustainable relationships. And I, I host Ash After Dark to help people to bring that spark back. You know what I mean? Now, I'm not ever gonna encourage anybody to have a situationship. That's not me. That's not what I believe in. Like I said, I am a Christian and God leads my life. But I ain't gonna act like it ain't still some heathen ways in me. He ain't done with me, he's still working on me. So we host Ash After Dark because I want to encourage women to know themselves, if you know what I mean. I encourage men to know their women and know themselves. I encourage intimacy. I encourage some of these conversations that are thought provoking so that we can really encourage relationships and nurture a better connection with our husbands and our wives, baby. Because I wanna see the nuclear family come back. I'm a firm believer that we need it. I'm a firm believer that our children need it and our communities need it. So I use my educational background. I use my lived experiences. I use my mistakes. I use all of these things to come and share information and knowledge content with you guys because I believe in being the change that I want to see. And if I want to see an improvement in my community, I have to start with me. If I want to see an improvement in the relationships 
the parenting, if I wanna see an improvement in our financial health, our emotional health, our physical health, I have to come in and lead by example. That's why my channels and platforms are titled Life in the Ash Lane, and I have coined myself your personal life guide. Don't call me a coach. I love to guide the way through so you know I'm in it with you. I ain't just giving you plays and telling you to go out there and figure it out. Oh, no, ma'am. No, sir. I am actually in the trenches with you, but I may just be two, three, four, five steps ahead so that I can tell you what to watch out for. Isn't that so much better? Isn't it better to have someone there two, three steps ahead that has already done it and I'm able to tell you Go left instead of right. Go right instead of left. Pause for a second, and now we can keep going. Y'all remember Indiana Jones? I know this is old, but y'all remember when he used to be going through the booby traps, the mazes, and he just knew if you step on this, the swinging hatchet is gonna come, and he'd be like, wait, and they would fall out of the way of the hatchet. I'm your Indiana Jones. I don't even know if that reference works but you get what i'm saying i'm gonna guide the way through life so i just wanted to come and give you guys a brief introduction of who i am why i am and my purpose my purpose is just to encourage the change that i want to see i am divorced because when i was married to my ex-husband i was very much a strong independent black woman i didn't need no man baby but i learned I learned a lot, I grew a lot. Sometimes we have to make some mistakes and bump our heads to know what we want and what we don't want. So that first marriage taught me so much that now I was able to really have some self-awareness, look at myself in the mirror and realize it wasn't just him, it was me too. And so I've done a lot of work building my self-esteem, building my confidence, I've done a lot of work, especially as a plus size woman, knowing my worth, but also knowing what role I play. Also understanding why I was created and what my position in relationships should be. And I know some of you ladies are not gonna like that. What you mean my role and my position? Based upon my beliefs, everybody has a different role or position a different part to play in marriage and when we get out of alignment as women trying to do what the men are supposed to do things get out of whack and they do not work and because that divorce that marriage and divorce taught me so much and i was willing to admit where i messed up i was able to do a lot of healing which i'm still doing know that healing is a journey it's never really done and so I'm really excited to share all of my relationship, you know, experiences, my relationship trials and errors, because I've learned a lot. And I share a lot of dating tips. I share a lot of flirting tips. Matter of fact, don't forget, honey, your girl wrote a book. Your girl wrote a workbook called How to Flirt, because I want women to be more encouraged to feel confident in themselves so you can flirt and attract the man that is for you, okay? Outside of money advice and outside of just real life advice and outside of relationship advice, I also share some of my woes that I've had as a single mom. I was a 19 year old single mom. My son is now 16, my oldest son is 16. And we all know that comes with its own stories and its own experiences. And so as I have worked through parenting and all of the trials and tribulations that that comes with, what I love to do is encourage other moms and other dads to not give up, to know that you are not the only one struggling to know that the mistakes that you made in the past in your parenting, you don't have to be that today. And am I a licensed clinician? Am I a therapist? Am I a psychiatrist? Not at all. I ain't got none of them certificates, none of those titles behind my name. But I am a parent who has been through a lot and I want other moms and dads to know you are not alone. And I share my stories with my oldest son because we 
we've gone through some things, but we on the way up. And then I waited 10 years. My children have a 10 year gap. I know, why did I do that to myself? But I did. So luckily I learned from parenting my first that I was able to do some things differently with my youngest. And that has given us a whole different result. And so I am really transparent on my journey of motherhood because baby, that motherhood hit different. And if you know, you know. So I have all of that. And as if that isn't enough, I come in as a woman and share advice as a plus size middle aged woman in modern society. Now, I know y'all are like, girl, please pick a topic and stick with it. I can't because it's life in the ash lane. And I am going to be transparent and open and vulnerable with you guys about as a plus size woman, the things that I deal with. I will talk about fashion. I will talk about makeup because anything that makes me feel good and helps me to be my best self so I can offer the world my best self, I'm going to share it with y'all. Because if it helped me, it may help you. So let me recap. We do Money Mondays where we talk about business advice. We talk about money advice. We talk about home ownership. We talk about insurance. Any knowledge that I have learned, I share because I want our financial future to be as bright as it can be, right? Then we just have overall real life advice. Regular day-to-day -day stuff, we just be chit-chatting and shooting the breeze to talk about real life stuff. Then we have the relationship and marriage advice. That needs no explanation. Y'all know why we talk about that stuff. The partner that you choose is the most important decision you'll ever make in your life. Why? Because that's who you're gonna have babies with. And we talk about parenting and we talk about the woes, the ups and downs, so you guys know you're not alone. And last but not least, we talk about womanhood. We talk about fashion tips, makeup tips, especially if you are a plus size woman like me, I'm here to encourage, I'm here to share, I'm here to educate, and I am here to be the change that I wanna see. And that's who Ash is, okay guys? So I am excited to take y'all on this journey. I know that I've already been putting out content and if you've already been watching the content, thank you. I appreciate you for supporting the channel, but I just wanna let you guys know that you are probably going to see a shift in my content because I am about to actually hold myself accountable, baby, to a schedule, to a program. So there will be certain days for certain content, right? Because otherwise, I'm just all over the place talking and y'all deserve a good quality, informative platform to enjoy and also be entertained, okay? So I love you guys so much. Buckle up, roadies. Oh, that's going to stick. So buckle up, roadies. Let's switch these lanes.